Okay, we're unboxing the Z-Ray R1 Race Inflatable SUP board. Uh, this is the third board I have in my collection, and we'll see how it compares to the iRocker and the Airhead. So, looking forward to it. Let's see what they have in the box. Looks like here is the pump. Um, looks like they give you a three-piece paddle here. Oh, patch kit. And the board, and we'll see what else is in here. All right, so here's everything that came with it. Here's the actual paddle board with a uh, strap down here. It's nice when you're packing it up. A uh, looks like an aluminum two-piece paddle. Very heavy. I'm probably not even going to use that. I'll stick to my uh, carbon fiber paddle I got on Amazon for hundred bucks. Pump, not double action, not triple action, just single action pump. Actually, it might be double action. Yep, I think it is. Um, and a fin, great thing about this board, it comes with this guy. No screw that you will lose. This is huge when buying inflatable paddle boards to attach the fin. Cool little cell phone thing they threw in there. Never buy these at a sports store. They'll be like 200% markup online. They're like anywhere from like 10 to $5. Um, I got one of these Dick's Sporting Goods for 30 bucks before I realized they're online. They threw it in for free with this board. That's for your phone. And a pretty nice bag here. Um, we'll see. It looks like it's definitely better than the iRocker bags, which will break within two months. So we'll see how the Z Ray bags hold up. So we'll see what it's like once it's inflated. Okay, so overall, the board was great. Uh, really good speed in the water. It turned really well for a 12-6 board. Um, a little wobbly. I fell off a couple times if you didn't notice that. Uh, but I think over time you get used to it. So overall, goodbye. I like it.